What's going on? Welcome back to the channel, Rookie Riches, where all we do is hustle and find new ways to make money on the street sand online, man. You know, it's a bad glare on there, my bad, but I'm in traffic, man, trying to get to the go Up warehouse, coming through downtown. You know, I picked this shelf up tonight, man. You know, I, uh, I was off today. You know, I supposed to been off for shit. Today, Thursday, I was supposed to be off Thursday, Friday, Saturday, come back Sunday. But, you know, I picked this shelf up for another driver. Dang, that glare was bad. I picked this shelf up for another driver. You know, so tonight I worked 6 30 to 11 and tried to get me to 5 30 to 10. I'm like, nah, hell no. If I'm coming in, I'm coming in when I want to because I ain't even got to be here. I'm helping, the, you know, helping the team out, helping out the Puffy family, you know. But uh, yeah, man, I'm about to get in here and see how much money we can make tonight. You know, last night I had a good night. I did $129. You know, the night before that, I, I, uh, I think I did 19 deliveries. Yeah, the, year, the day before that, I did 11 deliveries. For seventy-seven dollars, so you know, with that eighty-dollar bonus, I already got that. I only need ten more orders to get that hundred-dollar bonus, which I'm gonna definitely get that tonight. In these little four hours I work, these little four and a half hours. But yeah, man, about to pull up here shortly. You know, I'm about to find me an audio book to listen to. You know, that's if you follow my blog, man. That's what I do. I build it, growing here, learning stuff. You know, how to, I might, you know, sometimes I might listen to business plans and how to grow other businesses like i learned about cryptocurrency uh riding around in this car man you know i went and bought me some doge doge coin you know i did i went and bought some cardano coin you know i you know i've learned all that just riding around in this car man i use this car like a classroom man i just started a td ameritrade account just by listening to videos and stuff out of this out of this car man straight classroom on wheels man but not to get off topic man you know right now we are already sitting good at all about three hundred dollars in two days i work today then i come back sunday so this should be like a six seven hundred dollar week but i'm gonna get back on y'all in an hour with an update let y'all know where that money at document the grind document the hustle man we on that go puff grind tonight what's going on welcome back to the seven o'clock what a uh, 7 30 update i forgot i started late at 6 30 today you know i got a 6 30 to 11 shift man so far in this first hour Man, I only did two deliveries, man. I did two deliveries. I'll tell you where I'm at. I ain't had this pulled up yet. I'm at two deliveries, man. For I believe ten dollars and fifty cent, man. That's where we at after the first hour, man. You know, we a dollar over minimum wage. We ain't killing them, but you know, we making something, you know. Got the book playing by uh Deepak Chopra. Like, hey, what's Andy? All right, how you? Hell yeah, Hell yeah it is. <laughs> Hell yeah, shit. <laughs> I've been trying to stay cool all day. I don't even like AC like that. I don't even use the shit when I'm sitting still. Hell yeah, that's when I've been having it on, though. No. Hey, I got some super dupers. You would say that. I, heard <laughs> I just bought a half. Oh, shit. Earlier. Oh, shit. I'll just let you know. Yeah, how late you here? Uh, two one. Oh, okay. I picked up somebody's shift. I don't know who ain't come in. I'm working with somebody. Mm -hmm. But yeah, we have 10 50 after one hour. Get back on y'all in an hour, man. Book I'm listening to. Super Brain. It's by Duke Deepak Chopra and Rudolph Tansy. Deep book, man. Some some of the stuff over my head. I'm learning a lot right now. I'm gonna get back on y'all in an hour. Oh yeah, though. I almost gave my shit up. What's going on? Welcome back to the 8:30 update, man. You know when I did that last update, I was at ten dollars and fifty cent on two deliveries, man. You know, it's since I did that, <laughs> since last hour, man, I only did two more, man. Put me at seventeen dollars. You know, so all I made was. Shit, 650 to 325 we get per delivery. I did two deliveries. Ain't neither one of them tip cheap bastards. You know, but it be like that sometime, you know. But I know next week the unemployment checks come back out, man. That's when it's a good time to work. You gotta be able to judge when the money gonna be out. Like next week everybody gonna be tipping real swell, watch. You know, I'm up here at the Buffy shop, man. It's like shit, one, two, it's it's four drivers in the parking lot with me. And it's another driver out on the run, so it's six drivers. I don't even know who dropped the shift because it looked like we pretty pretty set on drivers, you know. But uh, yeah, man, I'm up here. 
Got my delivery.com shirt on, man. <laughs> man, I remember when I first, man, started doing deliveries, man. I used to have to go wait, wait in the restaurants for food and all kind of stuff, man. It was, but it got me to, if, it let me find GoPuff. It let me find a Walmart. It let me find an Instacart, even though I ain't did the Instacart yet. Uh, I am signed up already. I ain't never did DoorDash. We got a lot of door dashers in this area. So last time I looked into it, it was like a year ago. They wasn't even hiring in this area. But I think they are now, though, because they do more than restaurants. You know, I seen a, a door dash guy picking up an order from 7-Eleven the other day. I didn't even know they did that. You know, I heard they go to Walgreens and all kinds of shit. Walmart, I didn't even know that. You know, I thought it was just like restaurants. But they definitely going to expand. They're going to be competing with us if they doing stuff like that. Stay away from that puffy money. Or I'm going to have to start going to get some of that dasher pay, you know. But, uh, yeah, man, still got the Deepak Chopra book plan. He co-wrote this with another guy. Uh, Deepak is a medical doctor and Rudolph E. Tanzi. He's an uh, educational doctor, say PhD. But, I don't know, it's read by, uh, who's it read by? Shishir Karoop, you know? I guess it's like an uh, Indian guy or a Hindi guy or whatever, but, you know, I can understand him. His accent ain't real thick, you know. But uh, he just made a statement in his book, man. He called your brain a three-pound universe. That's crazy when you think about it, you know. You are what you think, man, so all day long. So you create your own heaven and hell in your mind, man, first, before it get exhibited on this earth. <laughs> but not to get off topic, man, we only at $17. It's a slow night, man, so I'm going to talk a little more. You know, I did. I had I, I boomed yesterday, so I ain't, I had a slow night tonight, so it's cool. But right now, seventeen dollars at the two hours, man. Got uh two and a half more hours to go. I get out at eleven. We are gonna see what we doing this next hour and a half. What's going on? Welcome back to the nine thirty update, man. I've been on the clock for three hours now, man. You know, shift six thirty to eleven. Take the second left onto you know, the road. I'm on a delivery right now. But man, when I did the last update, I was at four deliveries for 17. Oh shit, four deliveries for 17 dollars. Speed, he sped up like that's crazy, you know. But uh, yeah, I was at four deliveries for 17 dollars, man. Only making about 8.50 an hour, man. Nighttime driving zone, you know what I'm saying? But uh, yeah, man. In this past hour, I only did two more deliveries, man. Putting me at six on the night. For twenty seven fifty, you know, I think about last night, man. Shit, I had six deliveries in like the first, maybe I think it was like hour and a half, you know. But like I told y'all, I fluctuate and go up and down with GoPuff. You know, you never know, man. Life like a box of chocolates, you never know what you're gonna get. But I'll just be here vibing, man, chilling, man. I'm a man, you know, twenty seven fifty in three hours ain't ain't killing them, you know. I ain't even making ten dollars an hour, making about a little over nine fifty, little over nine dollars actually. You know, but man, I got the book playing Super Brain by uh D Pat Chopra and the other guy, I forgot the guy's name, but uh yeah man. I was just he just made a statement like about how kids view the world, you know, it's like endless. It's, it's like they you would have a new world every day because they always learning and seeing something new. It's like uh he was like when you get older, he was like, What happened to that same limitless you know, view of the world that kids have, you know, we be bound by past experiences and past people and opinions and all of that. So we we get away from that limitless mind state that children have, you know, like the world is so endless and you learn it every day, every day when you're a child, you know, everything is new. You know, you ain't got these false uh beliefs about the self that people that instilled in you just off like, you know, things they may have said or did to you in the past, you know. I don't know, man. It was just deep, you know. I, it'd be that'll be cool to view the world as a child again. It's just like an endless, wonderful world, you know, like how kids do, like because babies don't even know what correct, you know. what I'm saying they just they just move, they just do, you know, like a blindless, like a blind, limitless world, man. Like because you just Turn learn it all the time, man. That's then you're That'd be a dope. That'd be dope to be able to view the world like that as an adult, man. Cause you would just be so. I think you would be unstoppable and limitless. You wouldn't be bound by nothing. But man, not to get off topic, man. We at twenty-seven fifty. I'm 
looking for this address, but I'm gonna do another update in an hour. What's going on? Welcome back to that 11 o'clock checkout video, man. You know, I'm off the clock now, man. I only did like a little four and a half hour shift, man. You know, but when I did that last update, I was at, uh, man, I believe six deliveries. Yeah, six deliveries for $27. <laughs> like $27.50, you know, in three hours, man. I wasn't doing nothing, man. You know, that was like, what, about a little over $9 an hour. You know, in this last hour, I was able to do three more deliveries. You know, I got a $10 tip, too. But, uh, put me at $47.25 on a night. You know, it's like, in a four and a half hour day, that's about $10 an hour, you know, something like that. Not nothing to write home about, but it's, you know, I was chilling today. I ain't even really, I mean, I ain't wanted to be slow, but I ain't mad that it was. I, I was running all around here yesterday, 19 order, did like $129, I think. You know, good puffy money. But yeah, man, been listening to the book, The Super Brain, you know, it's elevating, trying to elevate, level up, man, in life, man. For real, man, with everything that I do and things like that, man. It was, we ain't get to the money tonight, but I was able to really just sit and listen to my book, take a lot out of it, you know. A lot of things to think about. It's like six or seven discs, so I ain't really get to finish it. I'm on disc two right now. But it's called the Super Brain, man. I got this from the library today. I don't, I don't listen to everything on Audible or uh, YouTube. I be going to the library still getting audio books. I be pre, I be ordering them sometimes. Cause you know I still got this O3 Camry. I still put <laughs> CDs in here, man. You know, I mean, I got the little Bluetooth thing hooked into the lighter joint but shit you know i'll still go grab some cds audio books you know that free up my phone too so i ain't gotta be doing all that with my phone you know, I can still get my messages and ain't stopping the music all that you know but anyway man not to make you know get off topic man ten dollars an hour 47 something 47 50 or something like that on nine deliveries I'm one delivery away from getting that hundred dollar bonus i did get the eighty dollar bonus last night but uh the hundred dollar bonus you know, I should crack that on Sunday. I'm off Friday and Saturday, but I come back Sunday. You know, document the grind, document the hustle. You know, peace and love, health and wisdom to everybody, man. Stay puffing, stay hustling.